Hello everyone! Welcome, welcome, welcome! Today I am going to do a quick recipe at the um, uh, on location downtown Toronto. So our dinner is tonight is a quinoa salad and cauliflower hummus and pork cutlets. I'm going to use first to start with our uh, micro grill, uh, pro grill. Our micro grill pro, uh, pro grill is this is a hard uh, heat a plate and there is a heat plate there. I have my cutlery there. As you could see, some of the stuff I prepared it ahead of time. The reason why is I'm all alone. So what I'm going to do first, I'm going to put this on um, not the grill, uh, not the um, casserole. I'm going to put it in a grill position for five minutes. Okay, let's start with this. Next thing, what am I going to do? I'm going to prepare my cauliflower hummus. Um, it's cauliflower tahini. As you could see, this is a tahini here, ready to go. And tahini, you could buy it in a container like this. Any brand is okay. Well, I'm going to add my garlic here. In our Power Chef, I'm going to put this one here. And our Sonic Power. Okay. Okay. First, I'm going to cut my garlic. My garlics are done, nice and cut. Then I'm going to, I used our um, a stack cooker. Our stack cooker, I used it the, the whole cauliflower. This is a season. I put it in there, cut it up, no water, and then it is all done. So this is done there. Um, And the reason why I had put them cone in there as you could see this cone what this cone does is that the waves goes inside and cooks it evenly all around it so half of it I'm going to put in my cauliflower hummus and the other half I steamed it in 10 minutes in microwave the other half I'm going to put in my quinoa salad Okay, that is done. Let's put this one here. This one here. Let's chop it all. While my, uh, what you call it? My pork is done. Now my cauliflower, even though if it's uh, cut, I still like to Add it there. And use my spatula, our spatula, our silicone spatula. Mix it all together. See, you could prepare your cauliflower, your steam it, your cauliflower a day before. I'm going to use this afterwards again for my quinoa. So you could mix it all together. As you could see, I'm going to add a lemon. As you guys know, I always like to put some zest in there too. It gives a different a smell and taste. This is you prepare it and put it in a Tupperware container and then what happened is that for a whole week, check it out, check the, yep, and let's, this lemon has been in the fridge a month, yes, finally I'm finishing it up, and as you could see, still juicy, because it stays in my Tupperware fridge 
check it out. Quit smart. So let me put some salt. some smoked paprika if you want to it gives a nice different flavor you like it's all your preferences and if you think if it's too thick you could add a little bit of water sometimes I use it um, I do put some yogurt, two tablespoons of yogurt, but unfortunately I didn't have it. And see, while my half of my meat is done. Perfect. My hummus is ready. Let's check the meat. As you could hear it, it's sizzling, 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 sizzling. Can you hear it? Check it out. One side is done. Now I'm going to do the second side. This is a... And as uh, with our... Uh, micro grill or any products you don't use any metal you just use it and i'm going to put some southwest chipotle it gives a taste our spot shaker is amazing so another four minutes then as you could see, I'm not putting it as a casserole, I'm putting it as a grill. Four minutes. Well, that is in the microwave. What am I going to use? I'm going to use the rest of um, cauliflower in my quinoa salad. Yes. I'm going to make a nice vegetable quinoa salad. I'm going to use my Power Chef again. And this time I'm going to add in my Power Chef. What am I adding in my Power Chef? I'm adding it, my uh, bell peppers. Just going to cut it to put it in there. I have those bell peppers since beginning of uh, September. Yes, three weeks. As you guys could see, it's still good. As I said, I'm just going to chop it a little bit. It's
check it out. How many turns did I do? Five, six, let's say seven. Also, bell peppers are in. It gives a nice color. Chopper is finished. Done. Check it out. Okay, nice and healthy. I did cut my onions, green onions. Check it out. I used um, our Tupperware. Check how beautiful, nicely it is in there. Green and red. Yep. And I, I cut it with our. Um, Caesar, Tupperware Caesar, which is very practical and nice. I'm going to add some dry mint. It gives a nice flavor. Some salt. I'm going to. I was going to do this. I forgot. Half a jalapeno. That's why I like to put it in there. I put it front of me that I don't forget. And I still forgot to chop it. Nice and clean, I could cut it in pieces. It gives a nice kick in there. Let me wash my hands. It's done, wash nicely. So, now we could mix all this together. Check it out, nice salad healthy salad. Now I'm going to um, use our uh, lemon squeezer. So one and a half lemon I could put it in here. It's, it's nice. Let me take that one out. show you guys how nice and smells awesome check it out so when the husband comes later on four cutlets are done so what am I going to put in my in my microwave in my stack cooker I'm putting it the quinoa so the quinoa is, I washed it nicely. I put it in, I put it in two cups of water and uh, now I'm going to put it in a microwave with our cover and let the steam goes in. It, it's on the instruction says 15 minutes on the stove. I'm going to do five minutes in microwave. While that is cooking, let's continue doing the rest of my quinoa preparation. We just have to add the quinoa in there now. Everything is done. It's a quinoa, red, red pepper, 
with cauliflower salad. Nice and healthy, seasonal. You know, I like to use the seasonal products because they are cheaper, you know, less expensive, let's say that. Yep. As I, you guys could know, check it out, all the, they're all in there. Let's cut this. Where did I put? Da, 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 da. As you guys could see how juicy nice lemons are it's nice I love lemon okay okay so all the ingredients are ready for my quinoa salad I'm going to put some olive oil in there around the half a cup a cup as much as you like As I said, did I put the salt? I don't think I put the salt. Okay, that is ready as well. How beautiful! Check it out. Nice, colorful season is coming. Uh, you know, uh, this weekend you could do nice, healthy salad. Yeah. So, what I have to do while that is quinoa is getting ready, uh, I'm going to go through our specials. Our specials is nice and um, beautiful. We have our pie keepers. We have a silicone. We have a bowl set, is on very nice and big. Hostess gifts, host your Tupperware party. I had done a party this weekend. Uh, we, we sold, I think we were 10 people, $1,600, yes. And that was a fundraising as well too for the church. You guys could do a fundraising with me. Let me know how I could help you. We have a gift ideas, let me, uh, tell me. And I give you different recipes for, you could put it in a, um, a spaghetti container and give it to somebody. We do have, I love these canisters. Those are a classic canisters. How beautiful it is. Wonderful. Yeah, that's why I wanted to, uh, to let you guys know. Uh, and then, purchase to purchase. When you purchase a certain amount, you could get this big, huge... A uh, canister for only twelve dollars. Yes, you heard me right. Tupperware for twelve dollars. Um, we do have a full line of a catalog. This month is amazing month for um, uh, for our record breaker month. One of the biggest months for Tupperware is this month. Let me know how I could help you, and then you could uh, we could do Tupperware party. We could do fundraising. If you have a bazaars, you know, uh, you need a Tupperware vendor, let me know. I'm here to help. My name is Ruth and my webpage is rudidi.ca. Let me know how I could help you. So today's recipe is hummus, quinoa salad with cauliflower, and pork chops. Have a fantastic day. Thank you for tuning up. Uh, let me know how I could help. Don't forget, my name is Ruth. And I am coming live from downtown Toronto, but I service all over Canada. Let me know how I could service you. Bye now.